All right, what's going on, tycoons? Uh, super excited for today's video. Okay, we are going to be looking at um, divergence, okay, and going over bullish divergence and bearish divergence. Okay, so right now I have the um, Options Trading Tycoons uh, Discord channel pulled up. Okay, the link to join that <clears throat> will be in the description below. You can use code Zachly, like the channel name Zachly Trades, to get yourself a discount on the membership. Okay, but we're going to go ahead and look in here. Okay, so. Um, we have some bearish divergence, okay? Um, tutorial on that, hidden bearish divergence, regular bullish divergence, okay? Which is what we're going to show right now, okay? So we're gonna, we're gonna, let's let's go ahead and actually start off with the bearish divergence at the top, okay? So um, I'm gonna pull up Ethereum and I'm gonna chart real-time bearish divergence and show you guys how it uh, affected the market, okay? So what you're ne gonna need to do is you're gonna need to pull up whatever you wanna look at. So we have ETH USD right here. You're going to need to go to indicators. And if you use TradingView, which is a free platform that I use um, to make these videos, you know, it's very useful. You can just type in RSI. It stands for the Relative Strength Index. Click that. Okay. And it will add it to the bottom. All right. Um, I'm going to go ahead and delete it. And I'm just using the default settings. Now, whatever trading platform you're using, they all should have um, an RSI indicator. So you just need to find out where indicators is and add the RSI to your thing. Okay. So what we're going to do is um if we take a look again at the uh what the what the ott discord thing says okay so regular bearish divergence is when the price makes higher highs but the indicator makes lower highs okay so here's what we got going on we're gonna look right here okay and this is the high point on the rsi so let's go ahead right here and then let's draw it up to our highs up here all right so clearly we are making a high and then a higher high all right and then we're going to go down to the RSI now. We're going to chart it from this point, where it is at this point, okay, up to this point right here. And if you look, that is right here. So that is a textbook example, as we just looked at, of regular bearish divergence, okay? So price makes a higher high, but the indicator makes a lower high. That's what happened. We have a high here, lower high here, high here, higher high here. And if you look, Ethereum fell, okay? Crypto in general started to fall right after that. That's an indicator that of signs of bearishness, okay? It does not mean that immediately you're going to see bearishness, right? Or that you have to see bearishness, okay? It's not meant to be necessarily an entry and an exit point on a trade, but it is a useful indicator that will give you indication of some bullishness or bearishness based on the divergence, okay? So let's dive into the next one, all right? The next one is going to be some regular bullish divergence. And that is when the price makes a lower low but the indicator makes a higher low. So we're going to look here and see if we can find some of that. Let's say, let's go here, right? Whoops, I need to draw my trend line thing. All right, so we're going to go right here. And we're going to go, um, you know, let's do like right there, okay? So basically, you can see on this trend line, we have a low, we're making lower lows, right? But on the RSI, let's go, let's, all right, so here's our low right here. So that's going to be this bottom. And then let's connect it to this point right here on the chart. And that's going to be right around here, okay? And we'll extend this drawing just a little bit so you can see a little bit better that this is going up, okay? So the price is making lower lows, but the RSI is making higher lows, all right? That is going to be bullish divergence, okay? And let's go ahead and take a look. I mean, you know, let's look at it right here. From that point, did you not see that we're now, you know, showing signs of bullishness ever since we hit these lows and made higher lows on the RSI, we are going up. OK, so, you know, that's two real world examples um, that, you know, I just charted up in just a matter of minutes. OK, that are really useful and helpful in you know, predicting where the market is going to go. All right. So we saw the insane run up and rally and then we said well you know the rsi is freaking making lower highs so we need to watch out we need to be aware that there's some bearish divergence we could see some bearishness right boom we got the bearishness now we're looking at the chart and we're saying all right we well we're, we're falling technically and creating lower lows but the rsi is making higher lows so now we have some bullish divergence okay so Hopefully this video helps you guys out. I try to make it as quick and short and sweet as possible and do everything from, from A to Z, okay? We went from a naked chart. I showed you guys how to add the RSI 
And all we're doing is using a trend line and drawing a trend line, connecting higher highs on the RSI, um, lower, lower highs on the RSI and, you know, the highs and lows of the price on the, uh, you know, the price chart. Okay. So that's really all there is to it. And if you found this video useful in any way, or you feel like you learned something, um, go ahead and drop a comment. Let me know that, um, that'll really help me out a lot. And don't forget to like, and subscribe as well. Um, you know, I'm putting out tons of videos. Okay. Not just tutorials, not just strategies, but I'm also giving you guys chart analysis. Um, you know, I'm going into some of the fundamentals, doing a little bit of deep dive on like, you know, certain stocks or coins or cryptos that I like, you know, um, and, you know, let me know if you guys want a video on how to chart, um, basically chart, uh, how to chart up patterns. Okay. Cause, um, you know, I really like charting up patterns a lot and, um, you know, there's tons and tons of different patterns. If you look here, we have a textbook inverse head and shoulder. Okay. That one played out beautifully. All right. We had our, uh, you know, left shoulder right here, left, right shoulder right there. Here's our head. We broke the neckline. We broke the neckline and, you know, we came up here and, and finished the move for the inverse head and shoulder. So, you know, good stuff going on there. Um, and, you know, I appreciate you guys. All right. Thank you.